Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm really sorry I've been gone for a while but I did mention that it was my last full week of uni and I have now finished for the summer which is brilliant so fingers crossed the quality and quantity of videos are really hype up now that this has finally finished but today I'm going to be filming a really really requested video which is the makeup collection video. All of this makeup I have bought myself or maybe I got it for Christmas so it's all not been gifted, nothing's been gifted. So I am going to be showing you that in my Alex drawers, but there's only about four drawers full of makeup. Compared to a lot of people, I probably have a lot of makeup, but compared to a lot of YouTubers, you've probably seen their makeup collections. I don't have much at all. But yeah, hence why I am not looking my best because this is the only part of the video you'll see me for. But yeah, let's start with the first drawer, which is my top drawer, which is foundations, powders, primers, setting sprays and concealers. I also want to apologise that the state of my drawers is not as good as I, as I would like it to be. I am going to be tidying these when I get a chance. But yeah, let's get started with the first drawer. As you can tell, this drawer is very, very full. I desperately need to get some more storage for it because I don't have enough of primers and concealers. But this is sort of just like an overview. So I'll be just briefly talking you through each section. So this section here is really hard to fit on. My tripod doesn't like tilt, so I'm having to do it with my hand. So I'm sorry about that. But this section here, apart from this, <laughs> is foundations and BB cream. So a few of my faves are the Bear With Me by NYX, Bare Minerals, Bare Pro, and Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue. But I've got loads of different ignore that there's gonna see this down there but i've got some tart products makeup forever but yeah um at the end i'm gonna be telling you a video i'm hoping to film obviously i haven't seen anyone this do this before i'm sure people have but if you would like to know what that video will be stay tuned to the end because i'm going to be asking you what your opinions are the next section along with concealers and primers this is so overflow i need to sort this out but some of my favorite concealers are the Ciate Watermelon Burst Hydrating Primer um, and to be fair I'm not really a big primer fan so that's the only one I really have which I love um, and then the, the only concealer I really use is the Tarte Shape Tape but I also have the Maybelline one, the Bare Minerals one, I think that's about it. Next to my primers I have my powders so I have a Rimmel Match Perfection, a Bare Minerals Bare Pro, a couple of Laura Mercier ones because they're both like got tiny bits left. Um, another Bare Minerals one, Rimmel, and another Bare, maybe even another Bare Minerals. I love Bare Minerals if you couldn't tell. And then at the back, I just have an all night waterproof full coverage concealer tester which I got given. And then I have three primer setting spray things. So my favorite is the, I'm sure you see me use this a lot in videos, is the Too Faced Hangover X. But I also have the Smart Smashbox Primer Water and the NYX Bear With Me setting spray. And then I've got some sponges at the back. But that is all for my first and to the second drawer. I have four separate compartments in this. Not the best organized, but <laughs> hey ho, it's all organized chaos so yeah this all section here which i don't know why i've got quite so many because this is all just blushes but as you can tell i've got a couple of benefit ones I've got the mac uh peachy keen i used to have dolly mix so i got rid of it but i really do like this one so i kept it i got the bare minerals mauve sunrise which is really nice it's like a sort of like a bounce sort of texture i've got a milani in luminoso Sleek blush in rose gold. This is like a classic cult favorite of like 2014 2015 YouTubers. I got a mini of the NARS Orgasm, which is beautiful. I can't even remember where I got this one. I'm just going to show you because it's so pretty. I don't use it too much because I don't want it to run out. I got a Lancome um, blush, which is bright pink, but it is lovely. And then I got this one, which I don't use because it's like older than me, but it's my Nan's blush. Her favourite, so I've got that one in here. So that's my first compartment, and now let's move on to this one here. Okay, so this one is full of like highlighters and um, skin illuminators and bronzers. So I've got the Benefit Hula bronzer. I've got a Kiko bronzer here, which is so big. I don't know why it's quite so big. And I've got two skin illuminators, which are the um, Number no. Seven skin, skin Illuminator, which is my favourite, and the NYX Born to Glow. And then that's the rest for that compartment. So here I've got my brows and mascaras. So I've only got two mascaras, so I'll just show you them quickly. 
Um, these are my two favourites, the Best in Sex by Too Faced and the Maybelline Lash Sensational, which is, I recently bought that because I'm running out of my Too Faced. And then I've got a lot of Benefit eyebrow products, a bit too much to be fair. I've got the Browsings, I've got the Cabral, I've got the, what's this called? 24 hour brow setter, I've got the Precisely My Brow, I've got the Goof Proof Brow Pencil, I've got the Gimme Brow, I've got the 3D HD Brows, and I think that's it for all the benefit things. I've got a set for Christmas if you're wondering why I've got quite so much, but my favourites are definitely the pencils and the two brow setting ones. I don't tend to use these two quite so much. I used to love the browsings, but I've sort of gone more natural on my brows now. And then I've got some eyelash colours in here as well. And a little, what's this, Anastasia Dip Pop Pomade, which I don't use as much as I used to, but I used to love that. Now that's back. Oh, it should be in here. This is a little Benefit contour stick. But these are all just loose eyeshadows. I don't really have many because I don't really use them. But I've just got a little collection glam crystals. Um, a Tanga Bear one, which is probably out of date, so I'll probably get rid of this after that video. Steeler Kitten, which is beautiful. One of the Steeler liquid eyeshadows, which are really nice. A uh, L'Oreal one, a Bare Mineral stick, and that's it. And at the back, I've just got one pair of eyelashes, which are huge. I'll just show you them. I would never wear these. I've just kept them because this is the eyelashes we used to have to wear when I did dance. So they just stay at the back. Yeah, now let's move on to my personal favourite drawer, which is the palette. As you can tell, I am a bit of a palette hoarder. I do, I did actually get rid of a lot, so compared to what I used to have, this is not very much, but I've still got a lot. So I'll just run you through a few of my favourites. You see me use this in practically all of my makeup videos, which is the Tarte Clay Must Have Palette, which I love. I've got a couple of naked ones. I've got Naked Cherry, Naked Heat, and somewhere I've got the Naked Two which I don't actually know what that is. I think a bit back. I've got the Too Faced Chocolate Bar, which used to be a classic favourite of mine. The Anastasia Contour Palette, which is really good. Anastasia Highlight Palette in that glow. The Tarte Tartlet Palette. Bare Minerals Palette. Anastasia Modern Renaissance. I've got a Z Palette with some makeup geek eyeshadows in there, as you can see. A number seven palette. A NYX palette, a MAC, I've only got one at MAC eyeshadow, I'm not a big fan of their eyeshadows, but I've got a little um, six palette there pan. I've got, what else is in here? I've got a Makeup Obsession palette, which is really nice, it's sort of a dupe of the Naked Cherry, I'd say. If you want to see like a comparison video of me doing like one eye Naked Heat and one eye of this, and let me know, because I'll do that for you, I'm trying to open it. As you can see, it's all very, very similar colours. Um, and at the back, as I said, I've got my Too Faced chocolate and there's the Naked by Urban Decay, Naked 2. So that's all of my palettes. I love my palettes. I do tend to use all of these. So I don't think they're all wasted. And now I will show you my final drawer, which is my lippies. So as you can tell, I have got quite a few lipsticks. I need to organise these a bit more because they're a bit of a mess. But here is a bit torn apart, but I just have... All my MAC lipsticks, which I've had for a very long time, so they're all very old. But I've just got to tell you some of my favourites. Velvet Teddy, everyone knows about Velvet Teddy. If you watched any YouTuber from about 2014, 2015, 16, this is what everyone was talking about because Kylie Jenner supposedly used it. But I've got a few more, and then I've got some of the Clinique Chubby Stick Minis, which I love. These are so good if you don't want like a heavy lipstick or you don't want your lips to dry out. But then in here I have just other lipsticks. So I've got a Jeffree Star one in Celebrity Skin, my favourite NYX in London, Too Faced Melted Matte, uh, Number Seven Lip Gloss, which is really nice, a Tarte lipstick here, Bare Minerals Gen Nude, Anastasia Liquid Lipstick. I've got so many. If you want to see like a full like lipstick collection or a full run through of any of my things I haven't really gave because I didn't giggle too much in detail because we would be here all day but yeah I hope you did enjoy this video the video I was on about earlier was like a full face of um favorite so I'll do like my favorite ever primer concealer you get you get the gist if you want to see that let me know and I'll definitely feel that film that for you guys but I hope you did enjoy this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up subscribe down below and I'll see you all in my next video bye